This time with the Quick Speed Shop, we're doing a science project with this evapor rust. I want to free up this rusty shifter body. Okay, so we're in the basement of the Quick Speed Shop. We're doing a little science experiment here. I got this gallon of evapor rust. It's a biodegradable uh, rust eater. It says America's number one rust remover. So what I want to do is I've got this mid-30s Ford four-speed truck shifter tower that I want to use in the Doodlebug project and it's rusty. It came out of the junkyard and it was in a transmission that had some water in it and the, uh, the action here is a little rusty so what I want to do is submerge it in this smashed up can I got and the first thing we're going to do is going to open this up I'm going to pour the contents into this bucket. I'm going to let it soak for 24 hours. I'm just going to take the shifter tower and immerse it into the liquid. Alright, so what I did here is I partially submerged the shifter tower in the bucket as far as I could, and then I took paper towels and I soaked them in the mixture then I laid them over the top of the unit like it says in the instructions and I'm gonna leave it sit overnight I'm gonna get a plastic bag and just put a like a shopping bag over the top of this to help to keep it from evaporating out of there too quickly and I'm just gonna let it sit and soak and we'll see what it looks like tomorrow all right here we are after uh, let's see about 16 hours and you can see this is a part that was submerged it's right down to bare metal all through here and there's a little bit of residue here in it, but it's it's cleaned up real nice this was submerged in a bucket like this and it's taken the rust right off right down to bare metal so I'm, I'm really impressed with that um, and it's starting to work on the inside too where the uh, sliders are so I'm gonna do some more soaking but it's uh, it's really coming out good you can see rust here bare metal here the only problem is my bucket, it ate the seal on my bucket a little bit. My bucket's leaking and I lost a little bit of material here. So I got to, uh, I got to get a different bucket. I'm going to get a different bucket and I'm going to reapply it. I might have to buy another gallon because I lost some material overnight. But I'm going to get a new bucket and reapply and we'll, we'll come back and see what it looks like after that. Okay. Ha. Ah. It's still coming out nice. It's uh, about three quarters of the way de-rusted. Oh, the sliders are getting good. Oh yeah. It's getting on the inside nice. The sliders are almost opened up. But it's not quite deep enough. Ah, I'm slimed. It's not quite deep enough to submerge all this. So I bought another gallon of evapor, evapor rust. So I'm going to hit her with another gallon. Hopefully this will submerge the whole thing so I can have it eat the whole, uh, eat everything up nice. Oh yeah, there we go. Bam. Bought this at Harbor Freight. It's $27 a gallon. So we got $50 worth of, $52, $54 worth of, worth of juice in here now. It's completely submerged in the bucket now. So I'm going to cover back up my plastic bag and I'm going to let it go for a little while longer. Hopefully it'll uh, eat the rest of the rust off that's not showing and will be good. So another day in the tank. That's looking good. Let me uh, get some mist debris on here. Oh, dang it. Oh, no. So, that was fun. So I could tell that it worked be because before the shifter was, was rusted in there and now it came out. So it's not rusted in there anymore. That's good. I wish it hadn't splashed all over the place. Look at that. Bam. The inside is completely de-rusted. It's super nice shape now. Wow. This stuff works great. The only rust that's left is up here on the tower that wasn't submerged. 
I could put this in upside down and kill the rest of this on top here. But uh, my shifter piece here, you can see there's a little bit of scale on it, but the end came free and it came right out. That's awesome. So the mechanism should work now, hopefully. So my conclusion is that uh, evapor rust is awesome. Look at this. It, this thing was severely rusted and it cleaned it right up. So it's taken like about four days worth of soaking here, but it's worth it. For uh, $50 worth of material, I got two gallons and I completely de-rusted this shifter for my uh, Ford Doodlebug project. So. I think it works great. This stuff's awesome. I'm glad I did this. So, as always, thanks for watching. Please subscribe. I'm going to put a circle ah, over there above the Vaporust bottle. Go ahead and hit that to subscribe. I'm putting out new videos every Wednesday and Saturday. So, uh, come back. I'm always doing something. And as always, we'll see you again at the Quick Speed Shop.